So you have an image like this and you need to get rid of the background. Maybe you wanna create a thumbnail image for YouTube like this one, or you wanna do something like we did with our website here, but you don't have access to either Photoshop or the premium version of Canva. So in this video, I wanna walk you through two tools that you can use for free to remove the background from any image or photo. Okay, so here we are at remove.bg. Honestly, this is probably the easiest tool to use ever. Um, without signing in or do anything, you can just take an image you have, drag and drop over the screen, let go, give it a couple seconds, here's the original, and then there you go, we have the image without, um, without the background. And then you can download a preview image, so you'll notice here's the, the dimensions of this image. If you do want something high res, um, you can get one for free if you create an account, otherwise you need to sign up for a plan and, and get credits. But you can see this will work pretty well, especially if you're using this for say a YouTube thumbnail or something that's not gonna be blown up huge. You can see maybe a touch here where my beard was, it didn't quite get 100% of the background there, but if this is gonna be something that's pretty small, no one's gonna ever notice that, so I wouldn't, wouldn't worry about it at all. One of the other things that you can do is you can click and edit the image as well if for some reason it either took something out or it missed something and then you can go to erase restore here and you basically choose how big you want say the the brush size to be and then you could erase something and so you know just to show you an example i could get rid of part of my hair that was sticking out right there um, as an example obviously if it was part of the background you could do the same thing and then you can download this image and there we go and so that's really how the, the tool works. And so let me just show you really quick. So if you do need something high resolution, what that looks like. So here you go, you get the one free credit. If you create an account, you can either sign up for a subscription or pay as you go. The other great thing here too, is if you look down further, this will work for people, products, animals, cars, and graphics or logos. So again, you know, this is something super easy. Anybody could use. Just take the image, drag and drop, and give it a couple seconds and the background will disappear. So there's the, so here you can see here's the, the image without the background and here's what it looked like afterwards. So obviously there's a bunch of different tones and colors here. It was able to figure out, hey, this is a person, he's wearing glasses, let's get rid of everything behind him. And so here you go again here. All right, so those two options with remove.bg. The other option I wanna go over today is actually with PowerPoint. So you're gonna say, Jeff, hey, Microsoft Office isn't free, but I do think most people have Microsoft Office. And with PowerPoint, you can actually remove the background from images as well. And so we can take the, two, the same images we looked at before, and here's the coffee picture. Then up here, you'll see remove background it's not 100% perfect and you can see it changes stuff to magenta that it's trying to get rid of. You kind of drag the shape to get everything you want to be changed. And you can see here, it didn't quite figure out the mug. What you can do is you can mark areas to keep. And then if you kind of click around what you want to not delete, eventually, there you go. We've got everything here and then go to keep changes. And there you go. Again, something you know not quite as easy or as accurate as what I did the first time, but in a couple of seconds, no more background. And then same thing, if you right click on it, you can go to save picture and then save that as well. And there we go, another example of something that took maybe a little bit longer than the other example, um, but another, another option for you. One of the issues I did have with this earlier, so you can see here, I have two of these outside picks here. This one that's seven megabytes, it was basically crashing PowerPoint. And so within PowerPoint, what you can do if you have an image here and it's selected, there's a little button here to compress. And so I'd compress this image. And then now if I go to remove background, and then again, you know, you kind of have to play around with it a little bit with the, sizing so it figures out hey don't forget about his shirt Oop. and then let's see here 
And then let's see if we can mark areas to keep and see if it'll figure out the, the blue. There we go. So again, you know, it takes a little bit of playing around with on PowerPoint. It's not quite as good as remove.bg, but here we go, keep image. Again, no more background. All right, so I wanna show you one third bonus option to remove your background, and this is a website called Pixlr. Um, up until recently, they had photo editing apps, these two right here, the Pixlr X and E, and very recently, I think they added this remove BG, and so let's check out how this works. Open image, let's try the coffee one. Open. Let's see how it looks. All right, so as you can see from this one, maybe it's not quite as good as some of the other options. I can see all around my hair, my beard, along my shirt as well. You can see just a touch of the background in different spots. Um, so this does work. Um, I would kind of put this in third place. I, I think it turned out better uh, both with remove.bg as well as with PowerPoint. But you know, if you're having problems with either of those two tools, why not give Pixlr a try? So there you go, that was two quick, easy, and free ways to remove the background from your images or photos. If there's anything else you need help with uh, related to graphic design, I encourage you to check out our playlist of graphic design videos. I'll link to those along the side here. Until the next video, bye-bye.